The strategy design pattern provides a solution for the following problem. How to represent uh, different strategies using objects in a way that allows our, co our program to change strategies by using other objects that represent those strategies uh, the program want to use. In this code sample, we have a class, its name is utils, it includes the method sort, a method that receives an array and sort it. The utils class includes a variable, its name is strategy. We can set that variable, we can assign it with a reference for an object by calling set sorting strategy a method with a parameter its type is sorting strategy sorting strategy is an interface that describes a specific strategy it includes one method the method sort each object instantiated from a class that implements this interface represent a specific sorting strategy meaning that when we call set sorting strategy, passing over a reference for a sorting strategy object, we actually set the start strategy for sorting the array when calling sort. Here in this code sample, we have two classes that implement sorting strategy. Each one of them includes the code for another sorting algorithm. When we call set sorting strategy passing over a reference for a bubble sorting strategy object, we actually set the sorting strategy for utils. In this case, when this code is executed, it means that from now on, calling sort will perform the sorting using the bubble algorithm. Let's execute this code. And here it is, we get the output showing that the array was successfully sorted.